Hi everyone, this is um, a weekly message for um, each uh, element. So it's going to be air, water, fire. So we're going to start with air. Thank you to those who like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel. It's much appreciated. My name is L. Let's get started. Okay, we got two cards. I thought we're going to do three card spread for air. All right. And at the bottom of the deck, the Seven of Pentacles. Eight of Wands. Queen of Swords. Page of Swords. So for my air signs, it looks like we have a female air sign. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius or female energy I'm feeling it's female energy there's some communication in regards to maybe a relationship the problems in a relationship the air sign wants to get to the truth of the matter it looks like the communication between another person is a bit hostile or it's short someone is looking at the time invested within a dynamic and wondering when it's going to pay off or someone is looking at a situation and saying this did not pay off someone's cut this off the communication is about is very telling it's very cutting it's very decisive seven of pentacles this is a a person who is reflecting on on time and energy spent there might be a capricorn here in the midst of Someone maybe deal with another air sign, fire sign, earth. Someone has wants to get down to the root of the issue. They have set aside the emotional and how they feel about the situation. And now they just want to speak about truth. Truth and clarity. Because this is going to help them decide what they need to do going forward let's pull a angel answer card for the air signs gemini libra aquarius it looks like someone is on the brink of deciding to just be done with or cut off or cut out so we give some information about well if this isn't going my way then I can go back to the past or I have somebody who wants me or it's a it's communication about um, where are we going here what are we doing compromise compromise here the Queen of Sources mm, not always about that she wants the truth she wants to speak it she she expects it from you um and then she makes her decision in that and a decision is a cutting away of and we've got the page of swords also you need to get some what this says you need to get more information about maybe the trouble the jealousy greed in a relationship before investing more time also you need to compromise in regards to having communication if the line of communication is open then also the opportunity to compromise in that situation should be open too um, I hope that this reading gave my ear sign some um, some clarity about their situation for the week uh, this yeah this is a weekly reading so it's going to run from november 26th to december 3rd um take care stay in prayer all information is below take advantage of the cyber monday sale also over at the website 50 percent off readings okay okay and we're back to do okay the earth signs so six of air just popped out of the deck some of you could be traveling over water traveling for the holidays um 
lots of travel cards this this is the season also some of you could just be wanting to get to a more peaceful state calm serenity in regards to let's see so we're going to do three cards for my earth signs earth capricorn virgo taurus capricorn virgo taurus all right what do you have to say for my earth signs all right three cards the bottom of the deck we have the four of water all right so let's see what this is about right. earth signs the hermit that virgo page of air ten of water okay so the air signs also have the page of air a lot of people want some truth and they don't want it to be long-winded they just want to know it's almost a yes or no question here are you in or are you out what are we doing um this may be for the hermit you, you're in separation from someone could be an air sign that you have a family with or you are separated from an air sign because you have a family um maybe earth sign you're you're involved in something where you can't see what you have in front of you because you're too busy with the three of cups you're too busy um maybe enjoying the three of cups the, the three of cups is you know celebration it's one man two women or vice versa switch it around it is dating it is celebration it's out it's enjoying it's um libations it's all of that you may be missing opportunity here because you can't see past the three of cups you want to date you want to be out um you're in separation from somebody who just felt like you weren't being honest about maybe your home life or home situation or vice versa so you may be dealing with someone who was doing this with you or yeah you need to really examine what you want and what you're doing you may be going in a circle so you need to there needs to be self-reflection and introspection here like okay what end goal am i trying to to have what end result some of you are in a family dynamic maybe with an air sign or, not, or virgo like yourself Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, um, you just are not happy. This air sign wants to know what are you doing in regards to your family. You may miss an opportunity because you are stagnant. It's taking you forever to do something or to see something here. See something clearly. Air sign could have cut you off or vice versa. Someone makes you happy, but there's a hang up here with the four of water to where you might miss opportunity to actually have something real and true. Examine yourself. That's what the cards that keep saying. Examine your wants, your desires, end result here. What do you want? What do you desire from here? It looks like you're not. You don't have any fire cards. There's no action being taken. There's you're comfortable. There might be an air of boredom or discontentment, but also comfortable. And that's why you're okay with the three of cups. And and you fail to see that so you might be missing what's being offered to you. Okay. So that's your reading. Earth signs. All information is below. Go over to the website. Book a personal reading to pull your information or, or your energy. Excuse me. Um, Cyber sale. Cyber Monday sale. 50% off. Take advantage of that. Um, thank you. Take care. Happy holidays. Talk to you soon. Hello, fire signs. Um, we're here to do... A weekly reading oh it will be from uh, November 26th through December 3rd here we are let's get started we're gonna do three cards okay three cards
And the bottom of the deck did two of swords. Okay, so fire signs. This is the energy for the week. The death card could be dealing with the Scorpio. Wow, the Emperor. Aries. Uh, Taurus. Ace of Swords. So fire signs, this may, you may be dealing with a situation where you feel like it's ending. See, the death card isn't like an immediate end, like you go home and you pack your things and you never turn back. That happens with people, but this isn't that. This has been happening over time. It's it's gradual. It's dying. It's it's death. Death is at the door of a particular situation, relationship, business, whatever. This is a business owner. This is a husband. This is someone older. This is a father figure. This is someone who um, owns a business. It's something's ending in regards to uh, connection or connections. We've got the Ace of Swords and then the Two of Swords, which will give us the Three of Swords. Something is... Someone is divorcing or separating themselves from. But someone's very clear, stern, even about the path that they're taking. Either it be newfounded or it's um, something they've been trying to do all along. They may even, yeah, somebody's cutting out something, also cutting off being decisive and divisive dividing from once again um, doing that by way of communication someone's finally going to speak uh, somebody felt like they were being you know pushed along or having to make a decision in the dark you could be dealing with a Libra fire sign Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, but Libra here. Um, feeling like you have to make a decision in the dark. Failing to see what's before you because of lack of information, lack of knowing. You know, the, the air signs, I know, you know. And so there's no knowing here. So it's almost as if you're moving in, in the dark where your heart and your mind are not aligned. You're not at peace with a decision. But you know that one needs to be made or something is dying. A husband, a father figure could be, there could be actual death or if not there, something is dying in, in, in between parties. Scorpio, Aries, Taurus, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. For my fire signs. There's a new beginning also. See look. Ending new beginning. It is victorious. Because you spoke truth. You were stern. And firm about it. You finally stood up to something. Or someone. Somebody's trying to exert power over you fire sign um you might the advice may be that you need to cut this out or you need to at least speak some truth even though you don't know where a particular situation is going or where it could go fire sign if you feel like this reading resonated for you with you aries sagittarius leo Go over to the website, book a personal reading where we can pull your own energy. Take advantage of the Cyber Monday sale, 50% off readings. Thank you. Take care. All right, happy holidays. Hi, Water Signs. It's Elle here to do your weekly read. This reading will run from November 26th through December 3rd. Um, it's just a general energy. Uh, may not resonate with everyone. Let's get started. Thank you to those who like, share, comment, subscribe. Okay. 
bottom of the deck, the Four of Pentacles. All right, so we'll come back to that. We have the Wheel of Fortune, nice. The Knight of Wands, Queen of Cups. So for my water signs, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, there might be some destined and fated change happening here for you. Maybe in regards to your status in life, whatever that may be or mean for you. Also maybe in regards to um, a large sum of money. This may allow you... This change may be fortunate. It allows you to either have a home move it allows you to have a career move it allows you to take action on what you're passionate most passionate and emotionally fulfilled with Or who you're most emotionally fulfilled. This is Cancer. This is Sagittarius. Um, Capricorn, Virgo, Taurus. Um, Aries, Sa Sagittarius. Yeah, Leo. Um, it looks like some change happens, and it allow it allows you to now take action and offer something's changed in regards to the status the wheel is turning for you Allowing you to move, have movement in regards to maybe someone that you're in and out of a relationship with. Someone that you have been holding on to but not giving very much to. They hold stock in your life. There is status for them in your life. You want to offer a cup to maybe a person who's close. Something changes and allows you to go back to take action in offering a cup to someone who may now be close off to you or vice versa. You never let go of this person. And maybe they never let go of you. But now there is a. Destined and fortunate. Looks like change happened. And it allows you to do or go to what you love. Also, some destined fortune change happens, and it either allows you to maintain your status or brings you to another status in life in regards to what is tangible and monetary and what is um, of value to you. Something's happening this week that it, and you're you're going backwards. You're going back to. Okay, water signs, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Um, I hope that some of you getting back with you want to get back with the the mother of your children is allowing you to go back. You were in and out and flighty, and you very well still may be. This person may be closed off to you. You may offer them some money or. Yeah. 
somebody hit the lottery it's allowing them to do what is passionate and loving for them okay so that's your reading water signs thank you for tuning in uh, once again all information is below if you want to go ahead and request your own personal reading take advantage of that cyber monday sale over at the website 50 percent off uh, readings um, just go ahead and you can book you can book and pay there at the website um, happy holidays stay in prayer water signs i'm praying for you pray for me as well take care guys